here with head coach Mel Mailer uh, before the Bonnies head off to uh, North Carolina this weekend. Uh, coach, if you would, before we get to the High Point Tournament, I'll talk about last weekend. You go down to uh, James Madison University and you come back with two wins, uh, two shutouts, uh, one nothing uh, on Friday and 2 nothing on Sunday. If you would talk about the trip and uh, the two wins that you had last weekend. I look at the trip as, as a wonderful educational experience for us. Uh, it would be like a teacher in the first day of school trying to sort out names and personalities and the nuances of, of, their, of, uh, of their, all their students. Uh, we were on the road for four days and it gave me a chance to not just see the players as, as players but as people and try to, to put together what we call the, the, the dynamics of our team. Um, so it was, it was a great learning experience for me and I think for the players as well uh, as we start to get to know each other a bit better. Uh, and I think that camaraderie led to, to, uh, to our success, quite frankly. Uh, uh, you know, we, we, we played well Friday. Uh, I thought uh, Asheville was a, was, a, was a real solid opponent, and it was one of those games that was up and down. Um, you know, we got an early lead, and, and they chased it for quite some time, and we had to really hold them off. And I thought that showed some maturity on our part uh, compared to the two previous matches against Buffalo and Niagara. Uh, come Sunday, uh, we had to learn how to deal with different playing circumstances. It was uh, 90, mid-90s, uh, middle of the day compared to a cool evening on Friday. Uh, a different kind of opponent, a very skillful, fast attacking team in Florida Atlantic. And uh, I thought we performed very, very well. Uh, I was real pleased. Uh, we still have our, our moments that uh, keep things exciting for us. But uh, overall, to, to go and get two wins on the road, uh, that was our goal. To get uh, what would be considered six points when come conference time. Uh, we found a way to play two different types of opponents, get two different kinds of wins uh, in and amongst all the other stuff going on throughout the weekend, the travel and, and, and everything else. So um, I guess, again, from an educational standpoint, it was, it was a real positive for us. And, and this weekend you head down to High Point, an even farther trip distance-wise mm -hmm. for you guys this time. Uh, you play Radford on Friday, High Point on Sunday. Again, two opponents that you never rarely play, uh, very rarely play. Um, what are you looking forward to this weekend and what do you know about these teams? I'm excited to get back and play and, and just see how well we can build on our success. That, that's always the challenge. Can, can we put together three and four now games consecutively where we defend well? And I, and I thought we thought we did uh, at, the, at the James Madison tournament uh, against two very good opponents. Uh, we're playing on a different surface, an, ast an AstroTurf type of field. Uh, in the heat, uh, I, I just uh, I'm excited. I, I think this will be a, a real true test for us. Uh, you know, we, we're still dealing with some injuries, and, and we still need to, to find some uh, some players to fill those holes. Uh, but it, I look at it from a positive standpoint. It gives other players an opportunity to perform. Uh, so again, we'll we'll see some different play, players play this weekend. Uh, and uh, after the weekend, we'll be able to sit back and reevaluate just how much progress we made. All right. Thanks a lot, Coach. Good luck this weekend. Thank you.